In this video, I'll show you how to configure email notification with Amazon Simple Email Service. If you don't have Amazon Web Service account, you need to get it. To do this, go to aws.amazon.com and click sign up now. After you finish all steps of registration and get your account, go to notification page of Managed Backup Service Control Panel and click Verify Email in SES status box. After that, you will get an email with link you need to proceed to confirm email verification. Now, let's go back to Managed Backup Service Control Panel and click Refresh in SES box, and our SES status turns to OK. Now, we need to go again to Amazon Web Service website and click Request Production Access. We need to fill up form and choose types of notification emails. Now let's go back to Notifications on Control Panel and in User Plan Report box we can configure notification emails. We can choose who will be get notifications, provider, user or both of them. We can choose in what cases emails will be sent, always or failure only. And also we can customize email subject. By clicking on the list of available matrices we can see them. Let's save this. Provider's contact email you can see on rebranding screen. Now, after backup completes, you and your users will get a notification email like this. On notification screen of control panel, you also can see group report box. It allows you to get group report about failed and overdue backup plans once a day at specific time. Now, email notifications is configured with Amazon Simple Email Service, which is highly scalable and cost-effective email sending service for business. All additional information about Amazon Simple Email Service you can find on their website. And of course, you can try how it works with Cloudberry Managed Backup Service right now.